Hey there, this is Ian here, and I know I do so many different things on my channel, you know, I sing songs, I do fitness training, I do motivational speaking, and today I want to speak about nutrition. Now, nutrition is actually very, very important. It means what you eat has an effect on the outcomes in your body. And I, one and a half years ago, I decided to go keto or, it is, or carnivore, keto to carnivore. That means I have lost a lot of weight, as you can see, and I didn't starve. I didn't go on any diet. I didn't, it wasn't the exercises, all the exercises, the resistance exercises, they simply enhance the diet. And so I want to tell you that I also take supplements, you know, as you can see the supplements that I take, I'm going to bring it a bit closer, it's omega-3 fatty acids, it's a concentrate, I just have to take it once a day. And um, because your, your body needs the proteins, right? We all know that. And so this is the fish oil that I take it. And it goes straight into my muscle synthesis. The next one I also take is this pre-workout. I'll bring it a bit closer so you can see there's a pre-workout. Okay. And, you know, this pre-workout has all this stuff inside. It's an extreme formula. That the body actually needs. Now that is why I'm doing this is simply because if I don't have enough proteins then I take the supplements, okay, this is the, and the supplements are very good as you can see. Um, then what I also take every single day is this creatine and uh, creatine is very good for your for your muscle buildup, you know, because uh, I don't do much training, you know, so I don't say that my, my training, it's what I eat that counts. And also the supplements, and this I take every single day creatine. <coughs> and now I'm going to tell you why I would like to speak about diet and nutrition, and mainly carnivore, carnivore meat diet, mainly meat products, you see, so bacon and eggs, right, and beef patties and steaks and um, chops, whatever it is, you know. And many people are saying that meat products are very expensive. But it's not true. If you compare the junk food with meat, with just pure meat, doesn't matter what, you will see that junk food is a little bit more expensive. Yeah, costs a little bit more. So don't tell me that nonsense that junk food, processed food, is cheaper, right? It is cheaper than real food. It's not true. And wherever you're living in the world, I know it's not always easy for you to have protein, animal proteins. But you should try it, whatever it is. And now sometimes there's even processed meat is better than no meat at all. Now, when you are eating carnivore, you automatically lose weight because your, your body is saturated. Your body has everything it needs and you don't feel hungry. You will feel hungry if you start eating carbs, if you eat bread, if you eat pasta, if you eat rice or potatoes, whatever. Now, you may tell me that potatoes are healthy. It's okay. You can say what you want. I'm just saying, telling you my experiences. And my experience tells me in order to gain muscle strength in my body and in order to reduce the aging process, right? I simply stick to carnival and I stick to meat eating. So every day I have bacon and eggs. 
butter. I have a lot of butter with my bacon and eggs. Beef patties, steak, chicken, doesn't matter. Now, what they actually do to the body, they clear your cells. You know, because my blood pressure at my age is pretty low, you know. And my blood pressure is about, I think, 110 over 70, which is pretty good for, for a man my age. And the reason why it's low is because there's no stress in my body. There is no stress, you know. And uh, the blood sugar levels, they go down. Okay, they go down if I continue with the exercise, because the exercise actually helps me to lower my blood sugar, sugar levels, all right, the glucose in my body. And so what other people are saying, you know, sometimes people can talk a hell of a lot of junk, and I can't stand it anymore. You know, just cannot stand it when people tell you, even doctors. They tell you everybody is different. Every human body is different. And so you, some people need this because of their blood, uh, uh, their blood types, and they need more carbs, and they need more sugar because of the blood types. You know, that is a lot of bunk. Um, people are starting to talk junk to you. Just leave them, you know. Human beings are essentially the same. You can even follow the history. The fact that human beings started eating meat made their brains grow bigger. And when they stopped eating meat and, and they at uh, agriculture or wheat or grains, and they got the fat stomach, you know. And so I'm just saying it's got nothing to do with every human being is the same. It's not true. Your body reacts to what you eat and primarily and that is a fact your body needs animal proteins now doctors are telling people stop eating animal products stop eating meat so all the people especially in this country are eating less and less and less meat as they're getting older and you know how they look like like old people and then I sometimes think there is some thing, some conspiracy behind that by telling old people to eat less meat and eat more bread and eat more pasta and eat more vegetables, all the stuff that all the sugars that causes insulin resistance. I don't follow that crap. So if you want to live a healthy life, make sure that you eat more protein then you eat carbs. Your carbs should be so reduced, I call it lower carbs, but more protein, protein products. And now for one and a half years, almost two years now, I, I have stopped eating carbs. I don't eat vegetables. I hardly, I don't eat fruit. I hardly do that. I mean, it has its place in your diet. But I have noticed, hmm, my skin stays softer, you know, for my, okay, for my age, I still have a very, very good skin. And that is because the collagen in the meat helps to sustain the suppleness in my skin. And you can see it, the suppleness in my skin. And you can have the same with, with you. You just look at yourself. You know, people are just saying, ah, oh, you can do nothing against age. No, no, no. You can do everything for your body. And that's why I have this program. And the program is nutrition. What you eat is what you get. Now, the pharma industry says, no, no, no. You've got to buy our pills. And so... They control, they and the food industry are working together. The food industry gives you wheat, gives you carbs, gives you sugar. You get issues. And then what do you do? Huh? You buy pills. You buy chemi uh, chemicals. You buy from the pharma industry because that's how they keep living. So it's a whole set. So I'm only telling you 
as a human being to another human being, I just ingest proteins, mainly proteins. And that's why I look so good. And the same can be done with you. So change your diet and you will see. I, I challenge you, just change your diet. I challenge you to change your diet. Cut out the sugars. You are the salt of the earth, not the sugar of the earth. Right? Cut out the sugar. And then, you know, to say to you, you must eat less fat. Your brain needs fat. Animal fat. Animal fat. The more fat, the more clearly you can think. The less brain fog you have. Eat animal fat. So when you buy yourself meat, buy fatty meat. That's good for you. Fat from animal fat does not make you fat. Do I look fat? Do I? No, I don't. And then, eat animal fat. Avoid vegetable oils. Avoid it. That's a killer. That causes strokes, heart attacks, and all sorts of meta me uh, metabolic syndromes. So, if you want to clear your gut, clear your gut with meat, with proteins, and then you feel the difference. Right? Okay, that's all for now. So have a good day. This is Ian signing off. Have a very, very good day. And remember, do things that make you happy. Because I told you in, in, in another video, when you are happy, when you are feeling good, that should be the most important thing for you. To feel good. And when you feel good, good things are going to happen to you. All right? So... That's all for today. Check you out. See you again. And click, just click and support me in my quest for a better life. Support me. I would appreciate that very much. All right. Thanks for now. Bye.